Good morning, everybody. It is Wednesday. I just made my coffee. I did add some creamer to it just because I felt like it. <laughs> um, you guys know I've been doing keto and I haven't had that creamer in a while. So I'm going to see if I even like it still. We are all twinning this morning with our shoes. Say... So the girls were being crazy in the AT&T store, so I left. Um, but yeah, they're pretty expensive, so we're going to talk about it because they're still too little to be um, having something so expensive. Mommy, so I brought them to Walmart and they look like they love these little carts. What? You want to walk? You like it? What? You have a baby. It's in the car. What, Zoe? How cute are these cleansing singles? But this is funny. Donkey milk? What in the world? Unicorn glow? This one is hilarious. So I wanted to show you a couple of things that I picked up from Walmart. I needed some rounds for my witch hazel. And then I've been seeing a lot of reviews on this rose quartz roller. And I'm really excited to try it. I need to put it in the refrigerator. And then um, you can, it's supposed to, can't even read that. Um, use with oils or serums to help penetrate deeper into the skin for increased skin benefits. Use with a sheet mask to work product more deeply into the skin for added benefits. Rose quartz is said to be healing, a healing stone of tenderness, nourishment, and comfort. It can help ease tension and stress the, and stress the soothe anxiety. And then I picked up some of my favorite lashes. I haven't had lashes in a while and I saw these there and I'm like, I'm gonna get them. So I did. I also wanted to share with you guys that I tried a new drink today. I had seen this drink on somebody else that's on keto. I usually do the grande double shot on ice, heavy cream and sugar-free, um, uh, sugar-free cinnamon dulce. <laughs> I always screw up the way I say that. Anyway, today I tried a venti iced Americano, two pumps of sugar-free cinnamon dolce, dolce, two pumps of sugar-free vanilla with heavy cream and cinnamon powder and light whip. Um, it wasn't that bad. I kind of am used to my other one, but this one wasn't bad. Just another option if you guys are on keto. I just made myself some chorizo and egg because I was starving and yeah. That is what's going on. Zia, it's 1.10 in the afternoon. Zia went down for her nap. And little Miss Zoe. I ended up getting them these today. With some little baby bottles. She wanted to put her dress on as soon as we got home. She's eating a hot dog. And she's taking care of her babies. Are you taking care of your babies? Okay, I don't know what you said. Your mouth is full, but you guys, I'm so upset. Zoe was pushing this, and she tripped and she fell onto it, and it busted right here. So I'm gonna see if Walmart will let me just exchange it. I know they will, but she fell on it, you guys, and it just popped. <laughs> it popped. So I'll probably do that later or tomorrow. I did put my lashes on that um, I just bought. I haven't, like I said, I would always wear lashes. Um, if you're new to my channel, you probably don't know, but um, I'm a makeup artist. I don't do it as, I don't do it on clients like I used to, and I'm not working, obviously. I have two toddlers, but um, my last job was with 
Lancome. I was with them for about a year and then I was with Chanel prior to them. And then um, I was at Neiman Marcus for Laura Mercier for about a year. And before that I was with MAC Cosmetics for about 11 years. So I have a lot of different brands under my belt. Um, <laughs> And it was always so much fun because you learned so many different techniques and so many different ways to do your makeup with different brands. Like everybody has their own way of doing things or each brand does. But anyway, um, I would always wear lashes to work. Like there wasn't a day that I did not wear lashes. So I was feeling a little naked. I did try lash extensions, but I did not like it. The maintenance on it was just too much for me. Um, plus I'm used to wearing different lashes like these are just the wispies I don't know if you can see them but I didn't even put a liner on yet I was letting the glue dry um, but I really like them they look pretty natural um, so yeah that was just a little you know 411 on what I used to do so anyway I'm gonna go ahead and just relax until hubby gets home and then we'll see what the night brings you guys so i got this like five days ago or so i can't even count the days but guess what i'm picking <laughs> comment down below and let let's see who can guess which one i picked but remember look at them closely because i'm a stay-at-home mom so yeah let me know which one you think I pick.